Somebody asked me to make them another sheep knob, but I don't have a ball attachment. Let's make one. That's a good one! I had my work called WM180 late for about a month. I've never made any tooling for it, and I thought, what a great opportunity to enter into the spare room tool making competition 2020. I would like to thank everyone who is donating their prizes for the first, second, and third, and let the best man win. Cue the music. <laughs>
Yes, just like that, I've got a bone cutting attachment. It's a simplified design, I've seen quite a few of them done before. It's very, very easy. I would say it's definitely a beginner sort of uh, project. All it is is a plate at the bottom that you attach to your cross slide. I don't know the names. And then you have the, the turning thingy bob. And as you've seen, I put a little bearing in there so it's nice and smooth. And yeah, just a tool holder in there and it's all adjustable so it can go back and forth so I can make different diameter cuts. And on plastic, on Derlin, I think it worked brilliantly. Here we are. That's a new shift knob for one of my Facebook friends. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you, you found it interesting. It's a slightly different format. I'm trying, uh, less talking. And yeah, if you liked it, leave me a comment. Uh, let me know what you think of it and maybe I can improve for my future videos. Don't forget to like this video, obviously, and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.